A Breton derby to warm the cold stands of La Moustoire as Lorient hosted high-flying Rennes. Seven without a win and three defeats in a row. It's not been plain sailing for Lorient. It was five years since they beat in Les Rues Genois. Added to that, Rennes were scoring freely. Nine goals in the last three, including their three-all draw with Vitesse and secure top flight in the Europa League group. Christophe Pellissier is Merlu, hoping to breach Rennes' rear guard, having scored in each of the last 17 home games in Liga Nuberitz. They went on the hunt from the start, answering Gerbic's head and having Alfred Gomez scrambling. One goal this season, Amari Trier had only ever scored twice in a top flight season for Rance in 2016. Mali fullback denied by Paul Nardi, hoping for a first clean sheet since Lorient's last home win against Nice in September. Well, a loose header gave Lovro Majer the chance to strike. The Croatian had scored the last time out for his first Liga Nuberitz goal, unable to add to it here. Well, Rennes earned 25 points after 14 rounds to equal their best tally of this season. In the 21st century, yet hadn't found a breakthrough when the new victory for them would take them second. Since Bruno Genesio took charge of his first round game, he picked up 19 fewer points away from home, but it was his substitutions that turned the away day in the Bretons' favour. Jeremy Doku heading on alongside Baptiste Santamaria. And it was the latter shot that fell perfectly for Gaetan Laborde. Well, after a hat-trick in midweek, the first treble for the club since Osman Dembele in 2016, Laborde in top form to gobble up with the class of loose save from Nardi. Ninth of the season between Montpellier and current employers to lie goal behind league top scorer Jonathan David. Well, Naif Aguirre picking out Doku. He still had so much to do, and yet he had the finish to make it count. The 19-year-old Belgian saluting the away support. The speedster showing his calm and cool. His third Liga Nubri's goal, but his first of this season. For Rennes, two goals, three minutes. Well, Terence Moffi started on the bench himself. The Nigerian could have reopened the contest and keep Lorient's home scoring sequence going. But after two goals in the first five weeks of the season, it looks like the goals have dried up. Rennes had to be patient then hit Lorient with a 1-2 to floor their Breton rivals. The Rougenois into second with a third consecutive win, while a fourth defeat in a row leaves Lorient only two points above the drop zone. <laughs>